iClone is a leading pioneer in character animation for everything from CG movie making to game design. Finally, the long-awaited and much-anticipated iClone 6 has arrived. Reillusion has completely revolutionized this new version by focusing our development efforts on a number of key areas. A completely revamped UI allows for a much more flexible workflow. The real-time engine has also been upgraded with the latest technology. Embedded content has evolved and improved in both functional and visual quality. And an open plugin architecture now allows for developers from all over to create their own brilliant additions to iClone. Traditionally, users have had to choose between fast and flexible real-time editing tools or cinematic level rendering quality. They've never before been available in the same package. Now, for the first time, iClone is bridging the two worlds with a revolutionary breakthrough by offering a real-time engine together with Indigo RT, a photorealistic render engine that renders in cinematic quality. Also, to simplify tedious shader setup procedures, iClone now auto-converts all real-time materials and lighting data into a physically-based format compatible with ray tracing capabilities. This gives users a much easier path to astounding quality render results. Indigo's RT high-quality render capabilities ensure realistic light behavior, whether the type of luminosity is emissive, translucent, or light transmitted. You can now see all of your favorite props and characters in superior visual quality. Combine camera DOF adjustments and tone mapping tools with exceptional lighting and render quality to make everything look amazing. Another exciting feature is real-time surface smoothing, which enhances the appearance of your characters and models by refining jagged edges to give them a more organic shape. This also gives a high-poly, refined appearance to your older low-poly content. Real-time used to be synonymous with low polygon count, but now by utilizing latent resources in your computer's GPU, iClone 6 is able to enhance polygon count in real-time, resulting in smoother and more detailed surface appearance for low-poly objects. In a real-time environment, it's hard to create detailed surfaces without raising polygon counts significantly. However, tessellation technology allows you to simulate the appearance of surface details via height or vector displacement maps. This allows you to create the illusion of texture on a surface by applying a pre-generated image map to it. This means that you can simulate a surface with more depth and detail without a higher polygon count that would normally be required. In addition to simulating surface details, you can also simulate the form of different shapes as well. Create a grayscale displacement map and apply it to a simple geometric shape such as a column to produce all sorts of unique props from a single object. Vector displacement is even more amazing in that it can produce incredibly detailed geometry beyond other displacement maps. By starting off with something as simple as a flat plane, you can simulate extrusion, depth, and crevices for amazing results. After extracting a vector displacement map from your detailed 3D model, you'll be able to apply it to a simple geometric shape with an iClone to produce results that are incredibly similar to your actual model. Previously, iClone required that you use an actual light as a light source for your props. Now, props have embedded lights with control panels you can adjust. Now you can attach lights to objects and create your very own light library, which will streamline your scene lighting workflow. We've also thrown that light number limitation out the window as well. Another long-anticipated feature is the new and improved soft cloth. By utilizing the new NVIDIA physics engine, your character clothing can now exhibit natural flowing motions. You can even bake these results and reuse the animations. Soft cloth is incredibly versatile for hanging, swaying, or rolling motions, and provides a number of pinning and map adjustment options to customize the dynamic controls for certain types of physics movement. We also added wind behavior for a self-animated option which allows for natural movement without external force. Characters are now also able to interact via physics with scene objects. Simply select the desired body part and resize the collision area for ideal performance. The physics constraint system has also evolved to allow users to easily drag constraint gizmos to snap to 3D objects. This approach makes it much easier to construct complicated mechanical structures with precise simulated results. 
In this example, the clock is controlled by the hinge motors, and it drives different sized gears to make this sophisticated animation. The newly enhanced physics engine will lead to more exciting visual effects in the future. The revolutionary new iClone QT user interface is now able to adapt to your working behavior and visual preference. There are also different preset layouts ranging from scene setup to animation or cinematic view. And you can now search for content in your library. The new UI can also be customized to help keep things organized in levels, according to your own personal preference, in order to quickly find the categories and specific content you're looking for. We've also included a couple of handy timeline enhancements as well. You can now do high-level keyframe edits on the master track without needing to click smaller individual tracks to find specific keys. This keeps motion key editing a lot more simple and streamlined. Another timeline improvement is the ability to select keyframes in multiple tracks and control them simultaneously instead of moving them independently one by one. By holding Alt and scrolling on the timeline, you can now navigate both up and across your timeline instead of trying to click on the small slider bars. Also, if you don't see the part of your timeline you'd like, you can hold Control and scroll your mouse wheel to zoom in and out. Probably the most exciting content update is the new generation of characters with stunning visual quality. The brand new One Piece G6 characters are designed for versatile body morphing capabilities. A single dress can conform to different body shapes, and the joints will also become more smooth and seamless. Enhanced face mesh topology will also provide you with more detail when editing and animating your character's face, keeping the expression smooth and natural. The texture is also incredibly detailed to give the characters a more realistic and polished look. Previously, a 3D model was restricted to a single set of material maps, which resulted in a pretty consistent look. Now with Substance Technology, you have the freedom to alter material appearance like never before to create more natural looking and detailed materials that can transition between styles. You can use preset materials like wood, metal or rocks with your own texture paint such as weathering, dirt, aging or rust to deliver astoundingly realistic final results. You also have access to Algorithmic's expansive library of materials as well. Adjusting various material parameters allow you to modify a single material in many different ways, such as pattern changes, modifying certain material elements such as lines, and, coolest of all, creating dynamic transitional texture effects. By utilizing built-in substance technology, a whole range of different physical materials can be generated from a single one by adjusting a few parameters. Another huge benefit is that the whole Biosphere system will be upgraded with the new Speed Tree technology. In this new update, you will find a lot more diverse natural content beyond simple trees, such as flying bugs, butterflies, fences, rocks, leaves, and plants which can also be arranged to create 3D text. Also, the grass has made the leap from 2D to full-on 3D. The visual quality is also greatly improved. All trees now come with multiple texture channels, including diffuse, normal, specular, and even alpha values for transmissive effects. From here, you can see more subtle details on the tree bark, as well as light passing through the leaves. There is also another great improvement in regards to wind behavior. High-speed winds will produce more realistic results, and you can use the timeline to key in wind changes from gentle to hurricane speeds. These trees also display different levels of detail at various distances to save on resources in your scene. In iClone, the transition between these levels is flawless, maintaining a consistent visual quality regardless of camera position. We firmly believe that iClone 6 will become a new milestone in real-time CG tools, and we're super excited to release the tool we've been working long and hard on. More than that though, we're looking forward to seeing all of the awesome creative productions from our global community of users. Stay tuned for the final launch in December.